question. Hey everyone, if you'd like to try out Filmora and start creating amazing videos, check the link in my description. That's where you can download Filmora directly. Don't miss it. Welcome. Let's start by dragging in a picture. Right-click to select Crop to Fit. Then move the playhead forward 20 frames, split the clip, and delete the remaining section as shown. Next, click the clip, go up to increase the scale to 115, add a keyframe point to transform, and set the Y position to 72, or simply drag the picture upward. Move the playhead forward two frames, add keyframe point to transform, reset the Y position to zero, and preview the result. Go to Effects, search for and drag in Depth Blur. Move the playhead three frames forward, split and delete the remainder. Then click the effect and set its strength to 50, then preview. Select everything, right-click to copy, move the playhead to the end, choose track one, and paste repeatedly for as many pictures as you plan to use. Go to Media, drag in another picture, then hold Alt while dragging it onto each clip to replace the timeline photos one by one until the last shot as shown. Select all the clips, right-click to apply compound clip, and then preview. Next, click the clip, go to Mask, choose Rectangular Mask, adjust it on the screen to fit, then scroll down and set the radius to 5 to give the corners a smooth curve. Now go left to Basic, set the scale to 65 as shown. Go to Effects, search for History, Drag and apply History Timeline Overlay 05 to the compound clip, then click it and set the opacity to 30 as shown. Return to Effects, search for Silent Film, drag it above the clip and extend it to match the clip's duration. Finally, go back to Effects, search for Aesthetic Light Leak. Drag it above the clip, extend it to match the duration, then set its opacity to 15. Thanks for watching, you're awesome, and the template plus Filmora download links are in the description. Have a great day.